beating on them and beating on them, and then I realize they come in two pieces. Yeah, I'm gonna need some new rims. Love you. I'm now leaving the apartment where I stay at for college. Ooh, If you don't know where this is, this is the freaking reservoir in Jackson. And that is a Mexican. And we live right on it. Okay. So now tell them what you did wrong. What happened was, is I went to get Angel from school, and I packed everything but his camera. So we had to come all the way back and get my camera, instead of just leaving from school to go home. He wanted to take my car anyway, so it wouldn't have made a difference, would it? Uh, can you get two 12-piece meals, please? Hey, what you drink? Root beer and... Coke. Coke. Coke, what else can I get for you? Barbecue sauce? Uh, Chick-fil-A sauce. Chick-fil-A sauce. Can I have a name for your order? Davis. We're getting our food. Oh. <laughs> My name is Jeffrey, and we're eating at Chick today. <laughs> and she has these fingers in my neck. Are you happy that I'm out of school for the weekend? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I am so excited. Mr. Davis? Yes, ma'am. Excuse me. How long is this going to take? <laughs> Answer the question. Answer the If any of y'all are planning on coming to Jackson anytime soon, don't. Because it is trash. Alright, guys, we're home. We'll see y'all inside. Psych! <laughs> I wish that was our house. That'd be a nice house, wouldn't it? Looky, looky, looky! Scraping the coast truck. Alright, you can go. And then we got another one. Right here. Looking good. Go to sleep. While she was driving. I guess it started raining and that is the best time to rain. Can we sleep? It's the best time to rain. <laughs> well, I got put the jacket on. You cold? I can't believe you gotta go to work and I gotta go home by myself. I'll be home in an hour and a half. Okay, now I'm woke up a little bit. Had a good sleep though. Seriously, it is really the best time to sleep is in the rain. Or when it's raining. I was gonna call my mom because when I got here, my little brother's not here. And she's not here. And they're usually always home. So I was like, what the freak? I go to call her. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna <laughs> no, <I'm> gonna... <laughs> yeah. We're going to Ford right now because I need to get my toolbox. Is it blurring up a little bit? Uh, nope. Okay, come on. I gotta get my toolbox because I'm gonna come back here and work on that go-kart like I promised y'all. Listen to this. You hear that water? If 
you're wondering why I'm doing this, it's because the toolbox already weighs a crap ton, so I'm gonna take some of the weight out so I can lift it to put it in the back of my truck. Yeah, I got crap in the Yep. Started smelling like that after you open the doors and whatnot. No, Ronchi up in here. I have to change something about that. <laughs> I don't know why it does that, but like it basically does that every time it rains like really, really freaking hard. I have no idea why it does that. This sucker's too heavy. I gotta wait till I get some extra help because I can't get it by myself. It's just too heavy. So next time y'all see this, it'll be on the ground in about like however long it takes to change clips. <laughs> All right, I got it down. This is my Sun Xbox. Doesn't have anything in it besides, I think, my welding helmet. Yeah, that's pretty much it. But all my tools, yeah, I had to back up over here instead of right there. All my tools are in the back of my truck. Gotta go ahead and get all that stuff put in. Right now, I got the go kart wheels. They are soaking. And some, uh, I gotta get all these bolts off because these this rim actually comes apart like this, it comes in half. So, already got the front wheels off. <clears throat> um, yeah, just letting it soak with some of this stuff. Liquid wrench. Well, it's back kind of doing that weird fog crap, like, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, just got through getting these freaking rims off. And, um, I was beating on them and beating on them and beating on them, and then I realized they come in two pieces. Yeah, I'm gonna need some new rims, definitely. Um, but yeah, I'm coming along with it. Almost got all my tools back in the first drawer only. <laughs> By the way, all my tools are gear wrench, except for my impact, air impact, and my air ratchet. Those are both Huskies that I traded uh, a Matco 3.8 for this half inch, and then the 3.8 ratchet, so it was a pretty good deal. This is a Sun Xbox. Um, I got it whenever, well, I'm still in college. I got it whenever I was there because I got 50% off because I was a student. So if you are a student, make sure you check that out because you might be eligible for that, for having the 50% uh, off student discount if you're a student for like mechanics or body shop or stuff like that. But anyway, just updating y'all. And uh, next what I'm going to be doing is, all I'm going to be doing is taking like all these bolts off, everything just apart. Everything that has a bolt, I'm pretty much taking it off. Because I'm going to have to sand down this whole frame, powder, uh, sandblast it, get rid of some of these weights. Because this guy, he was one-legged, so whenever he had it back in the day, he welded on weights to even out for his leg not being over here. But um... Yeah, I'm really happy with it though. But uh, I'm gonna go in and eat really quick. And then I'm gonna come back out here and finish doing this. And uh, hope y'all enjoy. I hope y'all enjoy this segment. Uh, this is, I'll show you my tools real quick. This is Harbor Freight. I forgot to mention that, that uh, this is one of the things that I have that's not so not gear wrench. This is uh, yeah, my cell phone. Uh, you know, sockets, ratchets. Flashlight, sockets, more sockets, Allen, you know, just normal stuff. Besides uh, some 
people might know is a you know, micrometer, dial caliper. Gear wrench, all of them. Uh, pliers, vice grips, all the stuff to beat with, including punches. I already showed y'all that. It's a welding helmet. This is gonna be my shop towels and gloves, my leads, bits, more bits, wire cutters or wire splitters, and uh, wire strippers. I mean, and a test light, which is completely useless. Which is the reason why I have a um, ohm meter or volt meter that I got also in there. So this is, I know this is not, I didn't show a lot about this in this uh, episode of my channel. But this is going to be what I'm going to be working on in the next couple of videos. So uh, I hope you all enjoy it and like it. Um, if y'all want to see more of this, please drop a like, comment, you know, and I will definitely keep working on it. But, um, yeah, I hope y'all guys enjoy this video, and the next videos will be more based off this, if that's what y'all want to see. So let me know. I appreciate it, guys, for watching my video. Please like, comment, subscribe if you haven't, and if you're new, I'm Andrew Davis, and I'll see y'all guys next time.